Hey guys, Jackie here. I wanted to show you just a quick tip. So one of the things that I've been doing on my KV core is sending out mass emails. And I actually received an email back from a couple of people that said there was not an unsubscribe button. Now guys, that's going to happen. People are going to want to unsubscribe to your emails, which is totally fine. So I wanted to show you a quick trick to be able to add that to your email. So that way you don't get any bad messages. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen. I'm going to pull up my KV core. Now, when you're looking at your KV core, remember this is your dashboard. Okay. So let's say that I was going to send out some mass emails. I'm going to go ahead and go to my smart CRM. My smart CRM, remember, is where I can pull up all of my contacts. Let's say that I want to send this out to people within a certain hashtag or maybe like a certain um, type of people in my group. So remember, when we filter our contacts, we go over here to filter. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to send this out to all of my closed clients. Okay. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to click closed clients. I'm going to do my prospects. Okay. I'm going to apply my filter. And what it's going to do is anyone who is in my CRM currently under the contact status of prospect, it's going to pull up. Now, what you really need to pay close attention to is this page number up here. So right now it says page one of eight. Now, keep in mind, I have this on 250 rows. So there's actually 250 people in here. So when I click this first name, the only people that it's going to attach to is page one. So whatever email I send out, I'm going to have to send it out. Yes, you guess it, eight separate times. So, but the purpose of this video is to show you how to add the unsubscribe. So we're going to go ahead and add our math email. Okay, obviously when you're sending out an email, you want to make sure that you have a subject line. So make your subject, whatever it is. Down in here, you're going to add your content. Once you've added your content, go up to the little um, sun, you're going to go to the lead and you're going to add the unsubscribe URL. Yes, guys, what that's going to do when you add that in there is it's going to make sure that anyone who is receiving an email from you is able to unsubscribe immediately. What that's going to do is it's going to show trust. It's also going to ensure that the people who you are sending emails to are actually wanting information from you. So I hope this was helpful. I hope that the tip um, was beneficial to you. And remember, hit that subscribe button and make sure that you're checking out more of my tips and tricks. Bye, guys.